good morning it's not even morning it's almost 12 or 1 o'clock i'm here to do another diy i'm going to attempt to do a diy i had i've had this makeup table you see how everything is there but the only thing that i haven't cleaned up is from the straw because i want to put this marble paper I don't know if you can see but it's a marble on top because it's really it's been really really hard really hard so so hard to maintain and to keep this table clean and my makeup is staining and I decided just to put the foil on top because it's kind of a plastic finish it's going to be easy to clean and it's not going to stain so I'm just going to put the marbles just on top of this, just where I always, most of the places that I touch. Yeah, and see <laughs> if it's going to work. I'm going to attempt to do it. If it doesn't work, I don't think, I don't think it's going to be, hard, to be hard. So if it doesn't work, I don't know what I will do. I just don't want to destroy my makeup. And I bought two rolls of this. Just in case, in case for maybe future other future DIY it's 200 times 55 45 centimeter that is more than enough I don't even think if I'll need all of this I'll just need a little bit for here and my husband is going to screw this out because it's heavy and I don't want to break anything and then I will lie it down there and then work with this and it's really raining. I just came from the, <laughs> from the supermarket to buy some paprika, I don't know, paprika, pili pili ho ho, that I, I needed the yellow ones. So I just came right in and started to rain and I was with my bike. Oh my God, how lucky am I? So yeah, I just wanted to update you and let me show you this is the before. And I will show you the after. So finished. It was a little bit of a hard work. We wanted to remove this, but it was too much work. But so we'll just cut here. It's not under there. It's just from here to the other side. This is how it looks now. Much more better. It's easy to clean. Yeah, and we will see maybe later if I will put some on here this part. But for now, that will do. Um, now I'm doing this part over here. I've finished with the upper shelves. That's where all my setting sprays goes. This is my for my wipes, and this is where I'm everywhere, everywhere my my brushes goes. And here in the middle, there's always an, a mirror. Now I'm left. Um, I have only these two and. If everything goes well, I will do the straw too. So let's see how it will go. And then you see how this DIY will end up.
what I'm right now what am I about to do is to look like to find the place where there's like bigger bubbles and use this kind of a pin and just put a small hole in there and then use my card to kind of get rid of that those bubbles and the only places that has bubbles is on this plate this bigger part and yeah it was really hard because the foil itself was not really straight and also something else we didn't remove this part of the mirror so it was really quite a, a, a little bit hard to to do to do this part the, the lower part but yeah i'm done with the upper shelves and then now i'm just trying to see if i will do this part you see the stains this ones are not coming up these are from foundation mostly uh, most of them are from foundation because them the, um, and concealer because anything powder was wiping really nice but yeah i love it it likes like like it looks really nice and yeah it doesn't look I just I don't know I just love try I just love personalizing stuff for me even when I buy something maybe from a shop like H&M CNA all these Zara all these shops because I know they just don't make one piece um, so I just try if it's possible if it's a jeans I try to make it a little bit of mine so that's what I just love doing that and this is really nice. Woo. So guys, let me try and plug the bubbles and then maybe we'll see when I arrange the table back how it was.